Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Rose Guy Gaming. This is your boy Sunny, and we're here with the first episode of the Road to Success on the greatest game in the world right now. FIFA 14, everybody go crazy! <laughs> but yeah, now the greatest game is GTA. No, it depends on your taste of games, man. But FIFA 14 is what we're doing right now. We're back with the Road to Success. It was kind of a success in... Well, that kind of makes sense, Road to Success. But it was kind of a success in FIFA 13 so I decided I'm gonna bring it back in FIFA 14 whilst doing my manager career mode on the side Manchester United career mode you guys can check that out it's gonna be going alongside the road to success so make sure you check out both career modes the player career mode my road to success and my manager career mode with Manchester United because both career modes are gonna be beast so let's get straight into it okay so last time at the start of the road to success in FIFA 13 I took the wrong move I started at Manchester United and they had Wayne Rooney and Van Persie which means I didn't get to play so I actually went to Football League 2 as you guys can see I'm going to Football League 2 um, and I'm gonna pick a different team so let's just go through these teams and see which ones most likely to win the league so we can go with them and yeah let's get straight into that actually Chesterfield looks pretty beast I'm gonna go with Chesterfield I'll probably be better than a striker let's set this up match difficulty world-class actually let's go legendary makes our players better too half length we go with six minutes financial strictness we go with lenience sterling court lane that'll do squads use would download the latest that doesn't really matter for us disable first summer transfer window uh, we'll leave that off alright then let's get into that create your pro or use real player it's time to make Sunny. Okay, so we've made Sunny. Not looking too different to our FIFA 13 Sunny. But that's a good thing, I think. Let me know in the comment section. Is that a good thing or a bad thing that he looks the same as our FIFA 13 Sunny? And also, while you're down there, let me know is Sunny a beast? Or is Sunny a beast? New man to bolster Chesterfield. Sonny is the newest and most promising addition to the Chesterfield lineup this year. You're damn right. Boom! There's the layout for the FIFA 14 player career mode, and it's looking pretty nice. It's looking pretty organized. I like it. Okay, so we got our first email, and it's from our manager, and he says, our league expectations for this season is the subject. Let's go ahead and check these out. Keep an average league match rating of 8.4 or better. I'm going to smash that to pieces. I'm expecting you to score at least 25 goals this season. I'm going to score 35. Set up a minimum of 8 goals for the team. I'm setting up 80 goals. No, I'm joking. I'm not going to be able to do that. That's just inhumane, man. That, that's some next shit. Can I do that? I might do that. I might even bleep out that word. You know that shit word? Yeah. Maintain no less than a 29% goals to shot conversion rate. Does that even matter? Let me know in the comment section if that should matter on FIFA 14 or even FIFA 15, FIFA 16, FIFA 17, FIFA 18. You know, just the FIFAs in general or is average match rating, goals and assists just all you need really? Or maybe there should be something else there. Let me know in that comment section, man. But let's get straight in to Sonny's Road to Success. Alright, so we got another email and it's from Jeremy Diaz or Diaz, I'm not sure how you pronounce his name. And he says we're going to be focusing on Chesterfield, but at the same time, we're going to be getting an international job in the future if we can get that road to success going. And I'm going to be playing for my club and my country. And that's exactly what Sonny wants to do. This is new. I like that. I've picked you in the starting lineup today. Lee Talbot, Everett, Cooper, Smith. Oh, I'm guessing that's the lineup for the team. So hopefully we can win this match against LA Galaxy. Let's get straight into it. Through to Sonny. Sonny on the ball. Finds O'Shea. O'Shea finds Roberts. Roberts back to Sonny. It's Sonny! 32nd minute. Sonny puts it into the back of the net. Like a bullet! Man! That is how you do it. Look at that for some team play. And Sonny scores past LA Galaxy. Oh, O'Shea, find him. There you go, he picks him out. Morsey, shoot. Oh, he hits the post. Oh, man. All right, I lost my temper. And I took his face off. It's full time. We win against LA Galaxy. I think this is the team for me. Considering I scored the only goal of the game as well. 
That was a beast game. Beast for my first game too. But anyway, we got a match rating of 6.6. .6. Not as good as I expected with my goal and quite a few completed passes there. We got one goal though, one shot on target, no assists, but 11 completed passes from the short range and three medium range. And yeah, that's about it. We were out of position only twice. Anyway, <laughs> we, we went up to a 67 overall, which is always beast to be going up overalls. And we're going to go ahead and see what's going on on my menus page. Okay, so I've not been selected into the squad. That's alright. I don't really want to play the friendlies anyway, so I can go ahead and skip this game against Monarchas or however you pronounce that name. Don't know. But Chesterfield, hopefully they pull off a win. They're still my team, and I would hope for them to pull off a win against Maracas, which they don't. Govia gets the only goal. They only lose 1-0, but it's still a loss. You know, like we won 1-0 in the last game. It's only a friendly, so I wasn't so, like, put upset about not being left out. Not being left out. About being left out of the squad. And also, I'll probably just sim this other friendly game as well. I just wanted to show you guys my first game for Chesterfield. And that's exactly what I did. I've picked you in the starting lineup today. That's what the words of the manager was for the first game of the season against Rochdale. Let's get into this game, man. We gotta win this game. It's the first game of the season. We gotta make an impact. We gotta make a statement towards all the other teams and win this game against Rochdale. Let's do this. O'Shea finds Morsey. Morsey finds Roberts. Roberts finds Sonny. Can Sonny break? Oh, man. He that was a foul. He stood in my way. Smith to Sonny. Sonny's still on the ball. Gets it back to Smith. Smith plays it into Ryan. Ryan plays it into Dariqua. Dariqua plays it back into Ryan. Boom! Another goal for Chesterfield comes from Ryan. Come here. Come here, you. No, no. He's like, no, I don't want to go to you. Get away from me. What a good goal from Ryan though man, look at that, great pass from Dariqua, nice little dribble and what a goal from Ryan. Abadaki, what a name. Rose gets the cross in. Oh he's coming into the box, no, no he found the net. Cummins in the 89th minute, one minute from time. That's just got to be bad luck for us man, I just couldn't get the ball as sunny. And then my team give it away, and that's what happens, man. A great goal, though. I gotta give it to him. He had to put a lot of power into that header to get it into the back of the net. So, good goal for Cummins. So, we drew the game. 1 1. Ryan got himself a goal in the 45th minute. Of like two minutes before half time, and then Cummins equalized one minute before full time. That was just like. We were locked heads for like the whole game. There was not many chances, but we pull away with a 1-1 draw. Draw's better than a loss at the end of the day. And Sonny gets himself the worst rating he could ever get. A 5.7 match rating. Hopefully that's going to be the worst rating of the whole of this road to success. Because if I get any worse than that, I'll probably punch myself in the face. You know what? If I get any match ratings worse than 5.7, put it in the comment section. Shall I vlog myself in that episode two seconds after me getting the match rating with a punch to the face? Let me know in the comment section. You guys are going to be like, yeah, I want to see Sonny punch himself in the face. <laughs> but yeah, we get a 5.7 match rating. Not the best game for Sonny, but it's the first game for Sonny in the competitive world of FIFA at Chesterfield. You have not been selected in today's squad. That was the message from the manager. Kind of pissed at that. I want to punch him in his face. But that's probably because we drew the last game, you know. But we're going to go ahead and sim this game against Crawley Town anyway on August the 13th. I like the fact they put the real games in order, by the way, and the fixtures and stuff in the career modes in FIFA 14. Dariqua pulls away with the 1-0 window. What a goal from him. Didn't see it, but it's got to be one of the best goals in the world. I'm only joking. It was probably a tap-in, to be honest. But he is a right mid, so it could have been something from outside the box. But we pick up the win anyway. And let's get into the next game. Ryan Edwards is going to be out with a medial collateral ligament. That's right, medial. I think they were supposed to put medical there. But they put medial collateral ligament. For two months, though, that's going to be a long time without a good centre-back. So hopefully Chesterfield can bring a good centre-back to Chesterfield. 
Okay, so I've been picked for this next game against Southern United. Hopefully, we can pick up the win and Sonny can get himself a good rating because 5.7 was just not good enough in my last game. Let's get straight into this game and let's see, let's see what I could do. Takes a quick throw in. Yes, and I can send the crosses in into something. Oh, my goalkeeper's there. That was lucky. O'Shea finds Sonny. Sonny's still on the ball. Sonny finds O'Shea. O'Shea, oh no, he pulled him back. He tried to find Dariqua and Dariqua was getting pulled back. Talk about find Sonny. Sonny over the top. Not for you, man. O'Shea was supposed to take that and put it into the back of the net. <laughs> Look at that. That would have been great. And then Dariqua decides I'm going to take that ball down. Oh, no. Oh. That was lucky. But we still pull away with another draw, and it was at home. I wish I could have won that game, man. Is Chesterfield the right squad for me? That's the, that's the question I'm asking myself right now, man. But we pull away with a 0-0 draw. A crap rating for Sonny once again. You guys are going to see that. Let me see. There's 6.1 match rating for Sonny. One shot on target, zero shots off target, which is good. 100% shooting accuracy. But no goal still, and we st we're two games into the season right now. I need to start getting a, f a few goals, you know, a few assists at least. Another game for Chesterfield and once again Sonny is left out of the team. And I'm starting to think maybe I'm not as first team as I thought I was. Maybe me and Doyle are still fighting for that place to be the top striker for Chesterfield. And look at that, Doyle gets himself a goal in that game. But we do lose 2-1 to Morecambe or Morecambe. And that's not good enough, you know. We need to be picking up those points to get to the top of the table. Okay, so I've been picked to play in the Exeter City game. But at the same time, I can't help but think Chesterfield need that edge in defense. In the, or maybe even midfield. We need something to supply the goals, you know. Maybe Chesterfield need to bring in a new player. I need my player to find me. Boom, there goes Sonny's header. Oh, it's not going into the back of the net, though. Roberts plays it through to Sonny. Sonny on the ball gets the cross into the box. Boom! Oh, off the bar! Don't play it backwards. Another nil-nil draw, man. This is just getting on my nerves now. Exeter City, nil. Chesterfield, nil. Sonny still hasn't got off the mark this season. He only got one goal in a friendly. Ah, this is starting to get on my nerves, man. But we have to pick up the draw. You know, it's better than the last match when we had to sim it without Sonny in the team. And we lost 2-1 to Morecambe. But we pick up one point for that game. And a 6.3 match rating. Look at that. One shot on target. One shot off target. One key pass. How can Chesterfield not finish that? And another crap match rating, man. 6.3 just ain't good enough. I think I'm going to have to go out on loan. So I can get some more people playing me in, you know. Maybe I'm going to put that in. So I'm here talking to my manager. And I was like, you know what? I need to request a loan. Now my manager sent me an email saying he's going to consider my loan request. And I need it, you know. I need players who's going to assist me and get me those goals. And that's just not happening here at Chesterfield. X, X, X. This is the worst start for the road to success. And it's just the beginning. Again, I haven't been picked for the Chesterfield first team. And it's against Oldham. And I was like, are you serious? I know I'm in bad form, but I need to get back into good form. And not playing me isn't going to help that. But we do pick up a 1-0 victory. And O'Shea, he does something when I'm not on the pitch. Yes! My manager has granted me my request to go out on loan, so hopefully I don't have to play with Chesterfield now until I'm a lot better and hopefully I can make the team win myself. So I've been picked in an away game against Portsmouth. This could be my last game for Chesterfield before going out on loan. It's in the League 2. Kind of surprised to be honest with you because... I thought Portsmouth would be a lot better. They should be in like at least a championship. They used to be a lot a lot more of a a lot more. They used to be a better team, like overall a better team when they were in the Barclays Premier League. I don't know what happened. They went all the way down. Hopefully they get back up. You know what? I just consider myself to be a nice guy. <laughs> but yeah, let's get straight into this game against Portsmouth. Morsey. Fine Sunny. 
Sonny back up to Morsey. Back to Sonny. Still Sonny here. Sonny. Sonny. My first goal of the season. Boom. That's what I'm talking about. 26th minute against Portsmouth. Arguably one of the best teams in this league. Well, one, well, one, you know, what was one of the best teams? Dariqua finds Ryan, Sunny again, over the top into O'Shea's boots. Boom! Oh, what a save from Carson, though. Great save. Roberts plays it upfield. It comes back to Ryan. Ryan finds Talma, who finds Sunny. Sunny tries to get it through to Dariqua. Dariqua's got it. It's Dariqua to Sonny. Sonny gets his second goal for Chesterfield this season. 62nd minute. That's a beast goal. I think I scored in the 26th minute. Turn those numbers around. I get it in the 62nd minute. Look at that. It goes through the defender's legs. Look at that. Nice little pass from Dariqua. Sonny putting it into the net. Beast goal for us. Oh. I actually stayed silent throughout that. I was kind of surprised that they got that in, but that was a beast header from the substitute, man. You can't take that away from him. It wasn't even the substitute. Don't know what I was talking about. 2-1. 2 one D-1. Sonny scores. 2-1. <laughs> but yeah, what a good game, man. At least we scored in that game. And hopefully we get that loan offer in now. Let's see. If we got that loan offer in, maybe I'm going to stay at Chesterfield. After those two goals, I feel like I should stay. And look at that go through. Look at my accomplishments for the man of the match. Sonny's the man of the match. Oh, Vision plus one is that? Yeah, man of the match. Oh, man of the match. Volley's plus one. <laughs> match rating 8.9. One of the best ratings I'll probably get with Chesterfield. But anyway, two goals in that game, three shots on target. Two goals from three shots is quite good. Two shots off target, one key pass. That was that big big one over the top into O'Shea when he got that volley. And he just couldn't put it into the back of the net. But it was a good volley. The, the, the goalkeeper was just too good for it, man. But we do walk away with an 8.9 match rating. Am I going to stay at Chesterfield or am I going on loan? You're going to have to wait and see. We're going down to two hours. And I get myself another loan offer. Who's it from? Who's it from? It's from Bristol City. Is that going to be the one to change my mind? I'm going to Bristol. Or am I? You guys are going to have to wait and find out in the next episode. It's been your boy Sunny. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. This has been kind of beast. Like, we've had losses, we've had draws, we've had the ups and downs, we've had the win at the end with the two goals from Sunny. Maybe I'm going to stay at Chesterfield for that reason right there. Anyway, make sure you stay tuned for this season of of the road to success and the rest of the road to success. Also, check out my Manchester United career mode. Check out everything on my channel. It's been your boy Sunny. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out. Peace.